Hi guys. Welcome back to PageFly video tutorial series. In this video, I will guide you how to create a Shopify password page with PageFly. Password page or coming soon page is the one that is used to notify, entertain or capture contacts of visitors when your store is under construction. So the first thing we want to do is head over to the PageFly dashboard. To create a password page, navigate to the password pages list. I will click this button named create a blank page here. Or click this blue button if you want to start quickly with our templates. Choose a password page here. And click here to use it. This is a typical page fly password page. It normally will have a short notification, a countdown timer, contact form and a box to enter password. Let's start to create a password page of your own. First, I will drag the one column layout onto the editor page. Then, add a heading. Paragraph. Countdown timer. And contact form element. After that, start to customize the styling of these elements. You can add background color or background image for the section. In this sample, I will add a background image here. Then continue to customize the styling of each elements on the page. Remember to enable the enter password option by clicking on the three dots icon on the top right of the screen here. In page settings, scroll down to storefront password. Enable the allow visitors to view page content by entering the password option here then click save. After customizing and you feel happy with the page, you can go ahead and click save and publish. Put the page title here. And click publish the page button. To view the password page in live view you have to enable password from Shopify admin dashboard. Here we are at the Shopify admin dashboard. We'll go to online store. Preferences. If you scroll down, you'll see the enable password. Check this box. And save the work. Go to the storefront of your page. After you enable the password, refresh this page, and here is the password page. 
If you see the default password page is shown before the one you created in PageFly. Go back to the editor page. In the three dots icon, select Visit Theme Editor. You can hide the default section from the Shopify theme by clicking on the I button here. Remember to hit save and check the page in LiveView. Once you finish your store, you can unpublish this password page in PageFly Admin. Now let's check it out in the storefront. And here it is. This is the end of the video tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel to get more new video tutorials. These are other videos on our channel you also may need. Thanks for watching.